it's a dog. We're gonna go take a ride over to North Shore. See what Paul's got in stock. See if he's got anything that anybody can use to catch these walleyes out here. Let's go take a look. Oh, this boat's all ready. Here comes another boat. We're gonna be late to the party today. Dark alley. It's bright in here. Jeez. hiding back here somewhere hang on back here in the corner got lots of hair jigs lots of hair jigs left been selling a lot of ripping ramps got a lot of new ones coming in soon though so we stopped at the bait shop make sure you stop by the bait shop next time you're in Ocano see what Paul's got for sale he's always got something that's gonna work out here on the bay um, he's dialed in on what's working what colors and all that good stuff. So stop by, see Paul. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> How the hell are you? We're doing good. And then head out to the bay, go catch some big walleyes, like we're gonna do. No. But you gotta unhook the goddamn strap. <laughs> Alright, let's start over. Okay? No, I don't, no, I don't feel No, bad. don't feel bad. That wasn't that was on me. That was on me. <laughs> okay. Oh. Sometimes you just gotta laugh at yourself. You just gotta laugh at yourself. You know, I'm not afraid to admit it. That was embarrassing. But hopefully somebody laughs about it. Uh, that's the first time I've really hooked the strap, left the strap hooked up like that. And uh, yeah, so hopefully that's not a sign of things to come. But we're gonna go out that way, look for some walleyes. I have a new Cade rod today to try out. Here's a prototype of our new medium light, extra fast hair jig rod. So we're gonna give that a whirl so we can catch a fish. I think we had a couple hours this morning before the rain comes. So hopefully we can find a few of them, test that rod out. Hopefully it's good. We can get some made and get into your hands. So come along, let's go catch them. Spot number one, we're gonna start out a little shallower. We're marking some fish in like eight, nine, ten feet of water. Do a drift here, see what happens. I'm gonna go explore a little bit more. Tilly says he likes videos when they don't drop f bombs, so I gotta be careful. Yeah, <laughs> I blur them out. Cade prototype, medium light, extra fast hair jig rod. Let's see how she feels. Let's give her a whip out there. You remember that fish that bit twice the other day, and you didn't set the hook the first time? Yep. I watched the video again. I could see the fish bite your lure the first time and you just didn't even flinch. I know, <laughs> I know. <laughs> Told you. Just stone cold. I don't know why I didn't sit there. I just sat there. <laughs> yep. I felt them. <laughs> hey, on the ripping ramp. Something different. Roger's gonna strike first today. We're all caught up in the net. Bad. 
I'm almost here. <laughs> there we go. On the rip and wrap. Can't remember the name, Noah. It's too Just a little guy. Good fish to start with. Gotta start somewhere. On a custom from North Shore. I might just have to go in search of today. We might the, go further south. The wind, the wind actually was blowing like this, like this, is way the way as we're coming in. Yeah. So Straight into the breakwater. Could be pushed into that freaking pocket to the north too. Yeah. Could be warmer water if we had warmer water out here, which. Right around the corner. All right, do we go north or south? Which way do we go? We're gonna end up back where we started. I've done that many times too. Yep. Yeah. Now you can put that in the video when I had my line hooked on the live scope pole. Is that the, what I felt? Said the hook. I felt yeah, something. Must, I'm thinking it hooked right here. Yeah, I've done that before. <laughs> I have done that. Is the pole in a better spot? Oh, fish. Oh. Ooh, this might be a decent one. Double twitch. It's not a small one. It's not a big one. I think he's hooked kind of funny with that double twitch. Thank you. We got one. All right. Cade rod. Double twitch. Snagging walleyes. So they are some walleyes out here. Just a little, little male. The black and purple. Tunks and hair jig. Those guys are subscribed. Are you? That's part of my fan club there. Well, we aren't catching shit. Nope, we are not. We thought we were good after the first two trips. Yep. Maybe I should remember to take the strap off the boat and we'd be catching fish. <laughs> Let's head back over there. Where the big bank of clouds are moving in, they're yep. starting to come. This one's gonna work. I'm gonna catch a fish on this one. There's like four of them there. Go back to the rip and wrap a little while. So, so we're throwing two different things at him. He's following it. That one hit it. Got him. Yep. That was a good bite. Felt the bite on that one. What is... <laughs> there we go. All right, just gotta grind them out. Maybe I won't go to Grind them out. Second fish of the day, finally. It is 11.35. We've been driving around all morning looking for these. All morning. Rod felt good. We'll see how the hook set looked. That one hit it. It was all, it all worked there. You're almost pretty much just dragging right now, are you? Yeah, I'm trying to go as slow as I can. I've been trying to pause it longer too. I don't know what they want right now. Right Mike behind, Tilly. Right behind them. Looking to buy a new fishing rod, he says. <laughs> buy a Cade. Bite. <sighs> Felt that bite. I gotta stop fucking around this rip and wrap. Another little one. Rod sensitive though, I definitely, no problem feeling the bite. Let them go down there. You, you can keep throwing the rip and wrap. I'm okay with it. <laughs> no, I don't think I can. I can get that much farther behind. <laughs> yeah. Yep. That one bit it. No stinger hook needed on that one. Another 
20 inch fish. There's definitely fish swimming out here still. Yeah, there's fish. I ain't having no problems finding them though either. Just having problems getting them to bite. Yep. Oh! He's coming down to look at. Yep. yep. Oh my God, two in a row. <laughs> two in a row. Two in a row. Everybody's right on the internet. Tell me I'm setting the hook like that. <laughs> These fish are just negative. Except that one. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> like a, a whale. <laughs> Jump. <laughs> Sounds a little bigger. I'm getting my ass beat right now. Maybe it's the new Cade rod. Maybe. It's not a bad one. That one can go all the way out of the water. Getting my ass handed to me today. There we go. Purple hair jig. It's kind of boring, but that's what they're eating. Because we can't barely get them to eat that. There's a little. 22, 23 incher. She was a jumper. I'm a big suspended one. I don't want to hit the hair. They ain't shouldn't be hitting or ripping her out. I mean. Oh, there's definitely fish down there. Come on. Oh, he was chasing it. Shit. He was chasing it. Yup. Oh, that one came back for it. Jumping walleyes. Trying to drag it as slow as I can. Right. Trying to drag it slow. I'll let you go. Okay. No, but I'm getting a learning today. <laughs> it happens to the best of us. I know. It happens. This is like bad though. 19, 20 incher. Oh, I lost them. I wasn't sure if that was a fish or not. I was kind of just dragging my bait along. I've never had to fish this slow before. Never. Always oh, on me. Come on. Yep. He was Bigger than the last one. Bigger than the last one. Of I don't know what I'm doing. I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on. He's off. I cannot get a hit. Female. Right now I can see five of them. Something about it today that I got going on. Roger can't get yet. Uh, Just bad luck. I don't know. Nice 22 inch female. See ya. I try, I mean, I try went down all the way even just to drag and I can't go slow enough, I guess. There, finally. Hey. I hear the rain coming. Roger's got a fish. You didn't know that? I did know that. Oh. <laughs> Eat it even. Every one I've caught had the whole jig. There you go. It's not a bad one. That might be the fish I just let go. <laughs> Same size. Finally. I don't know what that is. I think that is rain coming our way. <laughs> well, we're going to get wet a minute. A little rain cloud coming our way. 
Roger, finally got one. <laughs> finally number two after half a day. Yep. I gotta take the microphone off for the rain though. That's what it is. Yep. far away to get it to rain again. Thought we were on to something there for a little while. Two of them chasing it, come on. Come on. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yep. I don't know what I do out here. How do you hook it in the back? <laughs> Unbelievable. Just out here snagging walleyes. Just snagging them. Giving them the business. Roger's got a fish on. I'm jiggling it. We're back in the game, coach. That one's not bad. It's kind of a long one. It's like a male. Oh, come here. Yeah, you got the whole jig. That one's longer than the other ones. Probably a male. There you go. I gotta have you put this back on too when you get a chance. Let me just throw it on here real quick. I appreciate you helping out and cooperating. The people like it. I have my old fans. Now the wind's coming out of the east again. Yep. That little breeze. Another one. Two in a row. Maybe you did figure something out, huh? Uh, yep. Roger the hammer. It's all about presentation. Yeah, it's all about that cadence. Just figuring it out. Come here, you. Yep. All right. Back on board. All males today, seems like. Back in the game. Oh! oh. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> it's when I'm holding it here, letting it go back down. Yeah. It's when I'm. I think you're lifting it a lot higher than you think. I, I probably am. I'm, I probably need to lift mine higher to get more hang time on it. I'm just letting it drift to back to the bottom. Yeah. There, oh, I missed him again. <laughs> <laughs> I think I need more hang time. So it's weird. You just find something all of a sudden that, that works. You know. Yep. And he's doing it completely different over there. He's twitching it. Mm -hmm. I tried that. I couldn't get it. Oh, our count was wrong on that last video, too. Was it? Yeah. I, somewhere along the way, I gave you an extra fish. That's all right. You still won. I did. Either way. So you didn't have to try so hard at the end. <laughs> <laughs> you told me to try harder. I don't mind losing. I just want to have it blow out. Yeah. I don't want no 30 to three fish days. <laughs> I'm beyond that point. We haven't had one of those in a long time. No. Going back. It should be better than that. Since my birthday a couple years ago, that was a real, <laughs> that was a royal ass kicking. That was before you taught me everything you know here. Yeah, that was a double twitch kind of day. I hope he saw it. Yep. Right under the boat. Just a little guy. I don't want to boat flip him though. There we go. Don't want to boat flip him. 
Not with this nice tube breaker rod. Yeah. Well, he wanted me to test the durability. There we go. Oh, 17 incher. Vertical jigging. They definitely moved slow though. Yep, they are not moving. And I'm glad those bolts aren't moving either. They can stay over there. I can share with one guy. Austin's hooked up. Hooked up. Yep. There we go. <laughs> slow, slow, slow. It's the name of the game. Kurt, this rod's doing pretty good. No real complaints. Wish it was a little longer. But overall, it's light and sensitive. Oh, look at the fucking warts on that guy. Oh, 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 oh my God. <laughs> Look at those. That's just disgusting. Oh my, I don't even want to touch this fish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, yuck. For those guys that like their walleye cheeks. <laughs> there, you go. there you go. Look at the cheeks on that guy. <laughs> that guy is just disgusting. I wonder what causes that. It only happens in the cold water though. Eric, your stinger hook worked really good, but now the hooks are all bent, because I'm an animal. Good marks right there. There's good marks everywhere right now. Except mine disappeared. There's a pile of them out there. Roger's got one. You got a giant? No. All right, I'm gonna try and double up. That's fine. That's not bad. I ain't seen it. He's off. Oh. Easy. It's Warm hands. Decent one, but yeah. Not. Not oh. picture worthy or anything. Look at all those fish down there. Inching closer. Roger's hooked up. I'm over here playing with these little ones. Yeah. <laughs> it's a small one. You want to keep your one for dinner? You eat it, no. <laughs> we don't keep fish. He's still 20 inches. Little guy. There's a pile of them out there. Come on. You don't want to double twist. Oh, there we go. Four yeah. two of them. <laughs> Not a little one. Yeah. Roger's right on it. That's an eater. It's taken both of us all day to figure this out. You definitely got to figure it out more than I do right now. I'm losing it. We're just kind of drifting wherever. No real pattern. There's definitely a lot of fish right here though. We drove everywhere today. It's the only spot we caught anything. We went down to Pensaki. We went up to Peshtigo. We went to County Park too. That whole shoreline, nothing. You got a big one? Hey, okay. Been there. <coughs> Man. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's catching fish but me now. <laughs> I watch this one follow it right to the boat. Everyone but me yeah. now. It's not a bad one. That's probably the biggest one yeah. I had. The problem is the hat cam. Take the hat cam off. I'll go back to catching fish. He might be beating me now. You were feeling down and out for a little while there. Oh, you're beating my ass again. Oh, I was defeated for a while. For the life of me, figure out what to do. Well, now I can't figure out what to do. This one I did your trick and just jiggled over the side of the yep. boat. I had him down there, I could see him followed all the way to the boat. That's how I caught most of my fish today. Get him following it and then just start twitching it. Yep. Oh, that one took some coaxing. 
<laughs> He's not big. I'll net him. Once you get him good, that one took got, some coaxing. Got a good mark here that. Not small, but he's not big. It's been a while. There's that jig. Not hooked. Stinger hook in the mouth. Boop. See you. 1.58 p.m. That is a fish. I was adjusting my hat. <laughs> so far, I like the rod. It's got a nice soft tip. I think it's got a good bend to it. Okay. Oh my God, this is a gross looking fish. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that one is worse than the other one. That yeah. is just disgusting. That one is bad. <laughs> There's your eater. A lot of extra protein. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely got a few problems. <laughs> oh my god. I don't want to touch them. That stuff looks contagious. <laughs> Look at the nastiness on that walleye. Ooh. I'm just going to let him go. Looks like he had wings. Come get your eaters from Green Bay. Another one. Just twitching. Now I'm just twitching it. Little pops. Above. Yeah, just twitches. Get away from the live scope. It's a female. Is that no patrol? That one I'll touch. That one's safe. Stinger hook right in the corner of the mouth. Oh, right next to him. Another 21, 22 inch female. I'm gonna make a little video that cuts right in the middle of a... Hey, I'm tying up some hair jigs. Do you want to win some hair jigs? Like this? Or like this? Green Bay Specials Black and Purple Tungsten Hair Jigs? Well, as a thank you for hitting 2,000 subscribers, I'm going to give away 10 of these jigs to somebody that comments on this video. I'm also going to give you one of these boxes that I put them in. This is a Plano box with foam in it, with slots cut in it, that hold your jigs nice and tight. And it works really well. So if you want 10 of these jigs and the tackle box, comment on this video. Tell me what your biggest walleye is that you've ever caught. Tell me where you caught it and what lure you caught it on. That's all you got to do. And then in the next video that I post, I'll pick a random winner and I'll announce it. And we can either meet up in Green Bay or O'Connell or I'll mail it out to you. So thanks again for 2,000 subscribers. Now let's go catch some more fish. I want to catch one more, Aaron. Did I set the hook today? I'm setting the hook right now, Kurt. Can't talk. Just goes to show, you always got to try something different. If you stop catching fish, try something different. Don't get stuck doing the same thing all day long. Hey, Mark, whatever that is. Jumping right past him. Boop. One went down the way. Yep. There you go, and we can go. Oh. Now we can go. That should be a cool live scope view too. I was looking right at it when he did it. Oh, he's off. He counts. We can beat the rain. He counts. There it is. Black and purple tungsten hair jig. You gotta get you some of those. They just work. At least the last, do a good day. last three hours were good. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's spring fishing. Hopefully you put the boat back on the trailer a little bit easier. Then it came off the trailer. Yeah. Standing on that floating ice in the harbor. A lot braver than I am. Oh God, look at this stuff. I don't know if I would call this sleet or hail. 
ting, 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 ting. Well, that's gonna do it for us today. We got this cool sleet, hail stuff coming down now. We're done. We had a good day. It took us a long time to find those fish. Um, we caught one in the morning, one a little bit later, and we didn't start catching them until almost noon. So it goes to show that sometimes you gotta drive around, look for these fish, and find out where they're at. And you don't always know where they're gonna be. You don't always know what you're missing. So sometimes it's worth it to go drive around. Today it wasn't, but you never know. We ended up back where we started and put a beating on them. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed me leaving the strap on the trailer this morning. I didn't enjoy it, but you live and you learn. So if you made it this far, you're a legend. And remember, 